friends, it's Anna Komenda here and today I would like to show you new products from Mintai Papers. Um, I have four new collections and four books and let me show you what I have on my desk. Um, maybe I will start with collection and I will uh, proceed and <laughs> I will show you the books at the end. Okay, so we have four lines. Fantastic, Better Times, Day by Day, and Lady. And maybe I will start from the one on the top, which is my favorite. <laughs> yes, this is my favorite line. And in this line, we have 12 by 12 papers, but also paper pad. Uh, okay, so you can purchase single papers or you can purchase a kit uh, if you purchase a kit you will get uh, 12 papers so two of each design plus uh, plus this bonus cover and the bonus cover have all the elements to fussy cut on the back which is awesome uh, because you can use them like an ephemera pieces and I will show you all the papers. So this is the cover and this is the elements included into this collection. This is paper number one and paper number one, let me make some room here, uh, has a scene on it with a window and those are cacti, yeah. I'm so excited about this line because I love succulents. And the B side of this paper is this, uh, maybe I will do it like this, is uh, it's just a wall. It has pretty kind of um, rusty uh, orange uh, color. Another scene, uh, this one has a landscape with a beach and the B side is this, it reminds me of uh, beach baskets. Like, you know, they are waved, made of, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know of what, but it's a really nice pattern for the backgrounds. Uh, this, this is the third scene, uh, beautiful doors uh, with all the succulents and uh, gelati. And this is the B side of this paper, also perfect for, uh, for any um, backgrounds. Here is just a beautiful uh, sea landscape. This is the paper number four. And the back side of paper number four is this old wall. And it looks like it has a wallpaper ripped off uh, partially. And partially you can still see the pattern on, on the um, pattern on the wall. So this is just a perfect romantic background. And this is the B side of paper number five, which is um, floral pattern. You can never have Mintai collections without a floral pattern, of course. Uh, no, this is the B side of this and this is the paper number five and the B side of paper, paper number five is just a water, splashing water. And paper number six, as always, 12 three by four cards. And one side has those pre-designed scenes, clusters. And the second side, it has beautiful frames. You can cut them out and use them on your pages. You can put pictures behind them, whatever float your boat. And this is a sticker sheet that is included uh, into this collection. You can purchase Polish version and English version, which are the same when it comes to appearance, just uh, translated uh, when it comes to sayings. And the Stickers uh, in Mintai collections has a great quality. They are not just a very um, thin, thin stickers. They are cardboard stickers. So as you can see, they have a thickness, uh, I think about one millimeter. And the surface is like the papers. Uh, so it's, uh, it has this pretty matte finish. And you have words, you have empty uh, elements, and you have four rows of just words matching to the collection. And in this case, because it's kind of a summer travel collection, we have Explore the World, Sun Kissed, Staycation, Fantastic, Relax Time. So perfect stickers for this line. And this line also have a paper uh, number nine. 
uh, which has all the elements to fussy cut like this cover and the simple pattern on the B side, but I didn't get those uh, yet. So I uh, just want to tell you that there is an extra sheet if you would like to purchase. And we have a paper pad, six by six paper pad, which has all the designs that I showed you previously. Uh, each paper is double sided and we have four sets of uh, those papers. So we have um, 24 double sided papers and the cover on the inside has those pre-designed squares they are three by three inches and you have the same on the back so you can use them in your albums you can fussy cut elements out of them whatever whatever fits your needs and see all the designs are shrinked so all the scenes are uh, it's not like a quarter of the paper it's everything just downsized let me close the uh facebook it won't be beeping okay so this is the first collection the second collection is called better times and better times is a very joyful and colorful lines and as always when you purchase a kit you will get this cover and the back side of the cover has all the elements to cut out um so this is also what comes on paper number nine and i also don't have the paper for this collection i don't have this paper for any of those collections okay so this is paper number one and as always we have three scenes and this is the scene number one with beautiful rusty doors and some i would say idyllic landscape with a tree and um swing okay i was looking for the word and this is the uh, beside of this paper, just a simple wall, very, very delicate pattern. Another scene, paper number two, this one looks like a road to the enchanted forest. And this light area here is just perfect to put your pictures and some embellishments to create like a very magical uh, and enchanted layout. And this is the B-side of the paper, uh, number two, which is a colorful stripes. They have this watercolor look and they are just perfect. This is my favorite paper of this line. Paper number three, another scene. And uh, again, very idyllic. I love the colors. I love the motifs, the flowers, everything about this line. And the B-side of this paper is a blue wall, a bluish wall, because it's a very light blue. Paper number four has a wreath, which is also very bold. It reminds me of uh, summer on the countryside, at the countryside when I was a little girl. All the flowers and everything, it's just magical and perfect. And the B-side of this paper is a pa perfect wooden pattern, very light, so perfect for any background. And I just love the whiteness of it. Paper number five is full of butterflies. Yay, so you can fussy cut the butterflies. Mm, you can use it just like it is. And the B side of this paper uh, is those beautiful doors. They are just not decorated because this is something you can do. You can use this paper to like open the door and make it more interactive, uh, I would say. Uh, you can place picture behind the door, whatever load your boat here but this is a very inspirational paper paper number six again 12 frames 12 cards with three by four size pre-designed scenes or clusters and the b side of this paper again holds a set of frames um great thing is that if you cut out this and put it put it into your album you will know you will have a good b side like not a, only a part of some bigger pattern you can add a sticker here or you know picture and you'll get a perfect uh, divider in your album and oh i didn't take this one and we have stickers of course the same quality uh, and the same thickness of cardboard stickers and we have english and polish version and designs are exactly uh, the same words are uh, relating to the idyllic uh, times um, like the best childhood memories i would say happiness uh, peace of mind it's the little things in life happy time laughter 
hopefulness. So this is a very kind of positive and optimistic collection. And of course we have six by six paper pad. Again, 24 double-sided papers. Every, every paper is just downsized here. And again, we have four uh, frames on the uh, insides of the covers, three by three inches. And let's move to another collection. And this one is called Day by Day. Day by Day is a collection that was created for those, <laughs> I would say, uh, weird times when we spend a lot of time at home and we do a lot of home activities and we need something to scrapbook them out. And this is the answer. Uh, so we have a cover of the papers, of course, and the B side is full of motifs. So we have like homeworking, uh, we have uh, coffee, we have books, uh, we have some planners. Uh, well, this one, many of us do not use it <laughs> for a while, did not use it for a while. But flowers, all the homey feeling related items. And we have paper number one with a scene. Uh, it's also perfect for like summer in the city, I would say, and when you wander around your city and you have pretty pictures, but you didn't went too far, so you don't want to have a travel collection, this one will be perfect too. So this is the B-side of the paper uh, number one, uh, all the pretty windows. Paper number two, another scene. This one is like an indoor scene with uh, the couch, books, whatever uh, you have in your living room. And it's a good paper to scrapbook the indoor activities. And the B side of this paper is this pretty shabby distressed wall. And paper number three is another scene. It's another outdoor scene. Uh, this time it looks like a quiet place near the coffee shop where you just sit down and relax and you can use your pictures from wandering around the city. This is the B side of this paper, beautiful tiles. And I just love those patterns. They are so classical, I would say. And paper number four, flowers, as always, of course. And this, uh, those are flowers on the dark background. And I think we also have flowers on the light background. Uh, beside of the flowery pattern, another wall. Those are just perfect for any backgrounds and like in albums, uh, you can uh, embellish them whatever they want, whatever you want, however you want. And this is another floral pattern, paper number five. And this one has a light background on the back. And this is also one of my favorite papers, the green um, diagonal lines. And um, I think uh, this is also a perfect for an accent. It's not too dark, so it's not very black uh, and very, very, uh, I would say, big accent. So it, it, this one will be also most used by me. And we come to the paper number six. Paper number six with uh, 12 uh, three by four uh, cards. And we have all those home related items and scenes here. And this is <laughs> excellent sight because I just love those um, planner patterns. They are perfect for journaling. So you can cut out only the notepad or you can use it as a whole. And I just love this collection. This collection can be also perfect for all the planners out there, I would say. And as always, set of stickers, thick cardboard stickers. And we have Polish and English version in, uh, in the stickers um, uh, sheet. And we have um, all those like uh, feel good, everyday matters, our new reality, everyday matters, lifetime moments, together is the place, best place to be. It will be all, it all will be okay. Uh, so those are very encouraging, but it also helps you scrapbook the current times. And as always, we have six by six paper pad. 
and again 24 double-sided papers and we have four uh, pre-designed scenes inside uh, on three by three uh, cards so we have two of those on the front and on the back and it's really really nice beautiful patterns so this is paper number uh number no it's not a paper number <laughs> I'm already mixed up. Uh, this is collection number three. And now we are reaching to collection number four. This one is called Lady. And it's the perfect combination of emerald green and dusty pink. And we have a cover with elements you can cut out. All girly stuff like high heels, perfumes, pretty dresses. And uh, of course flowers. And you can also get this one as a separate sheet, paper number nine. And the back side will be like a simple pattern. So we have a cover and then 12 uh, patterns. Paper number one and pre-designed scene here. Um, and beside of this paper is this pretty, I don't know, how to call this pattern it's like a couch for me but it's a really great pattern for any background paper number two another scene this one has a window we have beautiful flowers uh, we have a mirror with the reflection uh, on inside and the b side is this beautiful uh, watercolor -y. Uh, pattern with this emerald green going on the ombre from the darkest to the lightest paper number three another scene the last one and this one has some frames and the mirror and tables so it's like uh, I would say a bedroom of the true lady and the B side is this beautiful laces all over so it's a very delicate and a very romantic and I honestly feel like this collection would be perfect for weddings because look at the flowers look at all those you know beautiful elements maybe the dress isn't white but all the other elements they suit wedding preparations perfectly so this is paper number four with flowers the b side of this paper is another watercolor background with emerald green Paper number five, another flower set, this time on the darker background. And uh, back side of the paper number five is this beautiful pattern, perfect for any uh, like a layout background, background. I just love this kind of paint strokes over something that looks like a page from the old, uh, I don't know what it is, <laughs> some uh, registration book or something like this. And the last paper, paper number six with 12 cards and pre-designed scenes. And uh, remember when I told you about the wedding? See, this one is just perfect with the bride and this one. And this one even has a white dress in here. This one also, um, and this one too. So wedding preparations can be scrapbooked with this collection perfectly. And the B-side of this paper are those frames. They are like in any other collection. You can cut them out, do whatever your imagination tells you to do. And we have stickers, cardboard stickers, Polish and English version. And again, a day to remember, beautiful memories, love her, soulmate, inner goddess follow your dreams this is your time isn't this just perfect for any bride i just love these stickers they are very encouraging so you can scrapbook your own selfies with this collection and make yourself feel beautiful and warm and you know all the best things so this is the stickers and this is the paper pad we have uh, again, 24 double-sided papers plus bonus uh, bonus things on the covers. Perfection. And let me move to the last new thing. Well, last four new things. We have four new books in this collection. And in this release, not the collection, because they are the product that goes beside the collections. You can mix them with any other lines. Um, so it's like an extra product you can use all over again. 
through all the releases and with all the collections. And we have Wing Book, Flora Book 2, Travel Book and Tag Book. And let me start showing it to you with Flora Book. We have six uh, different designs inside. Each one is repeated four times and you will get 24 double-sided uh, uh, sheets. So we have the cover and the cover also has a print on the inside so we can use it uh, for your card making. We have pastel flowers and pastel flowers are in a smaller and bigger sizes. We have a flora book number one uh, released in, uh, I think in November. And this one is a continuation. So the flowers are different than in the previous book. This is pasta number two and those flowers are bigger than those and they are perfect for layouts uh, because you can easily build a bigger reef with those. We have mixed stones number one with a lot of threads inside. We have mixed stones number two with a very rich navy colors and purples. We have leaves and co uh, number one. So we have like a, flo a floral element, berries, I don't know how to call them in English. And leaves and co number two, co number two. And that's it, all the six patterns. And as you can see, all the patterns have the B size with, a, I would say, coordinating colors on the back. And they are just plain papers with a little bit of distress, so you can use them uh, in your projects too. You don't have to fussy cut flowers. And again, we can go through all of it. We have four of each design. So this is Flora book number two. And now let's move to the travel book. Travel book is my favorite. <laughs> and I was the one who was saying, do it, do it, do it because I have a lot of travel pictures and I'm always lacking of ephemeras and M elements that I can add because they I run out of them the most. Um, so I have papers, but nothing to add to them. And we have six pages, transport with all the uh, transportation uh, things. And besides had this word map on the out inside in different colors. And I will show you. This is architecture and we have like a landmarks, the most famous landmarks from around the world. Of course, not each landmark will go here. There are just a few chosen ones. We have um, Tower Bridge. We have uh, Sydney Opera, Big Ben, Pyramids. I think this is Notre Dame. Uh, Leaning Tower of Pisa. Uh, Arc de Triomphe. I don't know. <laughs> call it in English. Uh, we have a Statue of Liberty, Santorini houses, I think, and Eiffel Tower, so like Colosseum, some of your most of tra most traveled, uh, I would say, um, cities, uh, you will be able to find elements here. And as you can see, this one has a map, like a plan of a city. Um, on the back side. Here are tickets and passports and they are also perfect to just lay them behind the elements and another world map. This one is a little bit different than this one, uh, like a bigger cut and luggage. So we have backpacks, suitcases, accessories, all the things you need to travel and they are related to traveling. So we have a globe, we have a compass, headphones, smartphone with the map, and like a travel diary. Mm, we have coffee, like, you know, probably everyone needs a different things, but this is what I use mostly. Stamps, they are just the travel stamps. Um, so you can search if you find something that matches your travels. There is Australia, London, Delhi, Sydney, Tokyo, Berlin, so maybe you will find something that uh, was included into your travels. And here it goes again, four times in total. So this is a travel book. Okay, the third product is a tag book product for lazy people like me. 
and we have six different uh, designs of tags. Uh, they have uh, the same shapes, but the patterns inside uh, are different in all of six pages. And um, well, all you have to do is to cut out the tag at the hole and you can use it in your pages, in your albums, whatever, whatever you like to use. So we have a big one, a few smaller ones and the really small ones. This is a pastel tags number one. And you can spot patterns from our collections here. So I think this one is, I am not sure, maybe from Tiny Miracle. Uh, the wall is, I think, from um, Day by Day collection. So <laughs> you can uh, try to search the patterns from uh, collections. This is pastel tags number two. And the B-sides uh, have this very light, uh, like a damask pattern. I don't know if you see them. Uh, colorful tags number one. So this is a dreamer. This is a better times, fantastic. And uh, colorful tags number two. I don't know this pattern. I don't think it's from any of the collections, but we have a red one, blue one, uh, flowers from paradise. And neutral tags number one, doors and like uh, wall patterns. And neutral tags number two, more wood patterns, the walls. So, and now here it goes again, four more times. So this is a product for a lazy people, perfect for layering. And the last product is a wing book. Wing book has all the wingy creatures uh, in here. And we have birds number one. They have like a smaller birds um, with uh, eggs and nests and the wooden pattern on the back side. Um, this is birds number two with bigger birds, more like a unusual ones, flamingo and the parrot and the kiwi, eagle, penguin. Um, so you can also use this one to kind of uh, uh, kind of enrich your travel uh, albums too because some of the birds are appearing only in you know the specific areas and we have another wooden pattern on the back this is butterflies number one page with the bigger butterflies they have all the colors of the rainbow another wooden pattern and butterflies number two uh, smaller ones but also colorful Moths and the dragonflies. <clears throat> this one is, I would say, for more masculine projects, maybe, uh, because moths are something that matches men. I don't know. <laughs> maybe. Or maybe not. And insects. Uh, those are just a cute little bugs, like a ladybug, bees, and all uh, colorful beetles. I don't know. I'm not an entomologist, of course and another wooden pattern, which continues four times. And this is just a perfect product. Of course, butterflies are my favorite. So we have four books and that's it. Thank you for watching. I know it was a long video, but it's not so easy and fast to show all of the goodies uh, like quickly. And thank you and see you soon. Bye.